feel like real housewives, ball wise. I feel like one of them because this hair really is is cute. What reality show I'm about to be on? Who I'm about to spill some tea on? Who I'm about to be messy with? <laughs> You know, it ain't me, it ain't me. I'm just saying those are the vibes that I get from the hair. Hey guys, so let's get into this wig. This is from the Dashley collection and it's going to be Lace Unit 28. I have this in color 1B. Can we give it up for the curls in the back? They are super cute. So this is going to be a middle part wig. You do get two combs on the side, a comb in the back, and um, you do get adjustable straps. So putting the wig on, I thought it was really cute. I'm showing you guys the density here. I think that the density is really good. I will go into a little more detail once I brush out some of these curls. It does come with baby hairs and I will say you will have to tint the this is the wig on and this is an up close shot of that middle part so this is supposed to have curtain bangs I don't want to like take all of the curl out or whatever on this but um I feel felt like I wanted like a fair faucet look like going backwards but you can see on this side how the bang does pretty well let me brush this but like one side always does better than the other but um let's style it and get it on and let me see what i can do because like this i don't like how it kind of sticks out here but like i said i think that once i like i don't know once i work with the front i might can get it to do maybe how hers is because you see how hers is just like it's going back and then it sits on top of the curls, but I like this look. So anyway, let's get it styled and then I'll come back at the end and see if we So like let's go ahead on and talk about the lace on here. So the lace on this wig is very, very soft. Now it is light, so you will have to like tint it a little bit. You can use a little bit of um, spray or you can just use some foundation. Now what I'm showing you is cutting it is super easy. I know some people, they like to glue it down and then cut it. I like to cut mine. Leave it in the comment section what you like or prefer to do. So as you can tell, if you want this wig to look really good you guys go in pluck it pluck it to the gods I'm not I'm making this wig a throw and go okay I'm wearing this wig for the night and then I'm gonna put her back up so I took and put a little bit of um hold just in that middle part you can make it um go down a little bit more if you want it to be across your forehead but that's all I'm doing then I'm gonna play with these curls so I can kind of get them how I want I'm gonna go through and take care of that hump and then um yeah that's it this is gonna be a throw and go let's get into pros and cons so this is going to be the final look for a wig. And she's really, really cute. I won't say that it's like a human hair look, but I will say it is giving you some curl bundles. Like it looks like, like curl bundles. So let me back up just a bit. This is where, yeah, I'm wearing black. It comes at on me, comes here. And the curtain bangs did come out cute. Like, I do like how it's just, like, formed in the front. I think that that looks really cute. And it did give me the look um, of the model. So, as you can see, that's the model. Look at my camera. Or my viewfinder here. And I think that it did give me the look. Now, for this way to be, I think, in the, like, $20 range, y'all need to run out and pick it up. If you can find it in a 1B run out pick up the wig put the wig in your wig collection and one day when you don't have anything to like you know wear like your hair isn't done it's one of those wigs you're gonna be like oh my goodness i can't believe that i have it i'm just going to go in here and i'm going to throw this wig on so that's what i feel about it now i will say that i'm good with the density some people may be like oh the density is thin i don't think that the density is thin i think the density is perfect because with you having curls you don't want it to be like too thick too poofy i feel like they did a great job with putting the curls and layering the curls and also making the density be natural looking now it is a huge i would say like a small con is it is a huge like difference between this front part and then how it kind of just drops off i will say that there is that difference but when you pull the hair like to the front you guys i feel like it's good when you pull that hair like up like this honey honey who is she who is she 
you can't tell me anything. Now, as you know, I did not glue this wig down. Sis, I'm not gluing it down. I went in, I just put a little teachy, teachy, teachy bit um, in this middle piece here. Now, what I end up using is what I always use. This is going to be the almighty bond hold in case you didn't see it. This is by Kiss. I ended up getting it a while ago. Some company sent it. I ended up using it and fell in love with it. And as far as tinting, um, it's going to be um, the Kiss Lace Tinting Spray in medium brown. So I did use that. Otherwise, this is a throw and go. And this is what I mean when I say throw and go. I don't mean where I had to like do baby hairs. I had to fix it up. I had to do that. All you're going to do is take care of that hump action that was up here in the top, which it was a little bit of hump action up here in the top. So I took care of that off um, my head and on the mannequin head. I ended up taking and putting some um, some spray on there, and you know, just pretty much taking care of it with some heat, a little bit of heat on there. Other than that, this wig is gorgeous. Again, put it on, <laughs> go somewhere, be cute for the night, girl. You come back and you take the wig off. It's gonna keep the curls, and that way the wig is going to last. And when you store it, what I would do is I would take all this, I would scrunch it up, scrunch it up with the net and then put it back into whatever you're doing like me I put mine back into my boxes um so if you have like maybe something else you're putting it in just make sure you take the hair down bottom and you just push it up that way it kind of keep the curls in it um and then over time if you want obviously you can you know just like straighten it or something like that um or you can take some big rolls put it in there dip it in hot water we all know how to do that when it comes to wigs hopefully so yeah this is really cute I'm going to I know I'm wearing black I'm going to try to Turn around and give you guys a 360 so you can see where it comes at on me. But this is pretty much where it comes. Like the longest piece is mid back. This is the back of it, so it's flat up in here, which is nice. It's nice and flat. And then it goes into all these pretty little curls. Um, same thing on this side. Like I said, if you wear it back, it is a huge, like, or a pretty big definition from here to there. But I will say that that is a positive thing maybe for summertime because you don't have to worry about like the hair coming in your face so you guys let me know what you think about it yes sis i know y'all like where have you been where have you been girl i know life was life in and we gotta talk about that later but other than that i'm back and to all my mothers out there you guys happy mother's day i'm so excited i'm a mother you guys should know that by now so to all my mothers out there happy mother's day i hope you guys are enjoying the day thank y'all for spending a little bit of your time with me today hopefully you caught this um on mother's day when i'm posting it if you guys haven't subscribed to the channel you know what I'm gonna say please subscribe to the channel and to my new subscribers I have so many new subscribers over here and I know I've been kind of like in MIA a little bit you guys I used to post like three times a week your girl has been MIA but I promise y'all promise y'all promise y'all I'm back I got like all these wigs I have got to post okay um so to all my new subscribers thank y'all so much for subscribing to the channel and all the people who've been rocking with me my day ones my a ones what's up my YouTube sis what's up I'll see y'all in my next video bye